In this project, we're making a functional 3D printed Pip-Boy 3000 using a Raspberry Pi and Adafruit Pi TFT. The components used to build this project are linked below and they're listed in the full step-by-step -step tutorial. The enclosure parts were 3D printed and designed to house the Raspberry Pi in the Pi TFT display. You can download the STLs and print them out yourself or have a service like 3D Hubs print them for you. We designed the parts in Autodesk Fusion 360 and they're available to modify and customize. The Pip-Boy Python program for the Raspberry Pi uses OSM for map data, which allows you to browse your terrain rendered in glorious retro green graphics. It features an audio amp and a speaker so you can play the actual score or background music from Fallout 4. An analog rotary switch lets you switch between different modes and you can toggle between different menu items. The 3D printed enclosure has cutouts for the Raspberry Pi I.O. ports so you can add peripherals like a Wi-Fi dongle, a keyboard, and even a mouse. The 2200 milliamp battery can be recharged over USB and it fits inside a pretty cool looking cylindrical case. The two halves are held together with really strong rare earth magnets, which makes it pretty easy to put it on and take it off so you can wear it with your favorite dweller jumpsuit. So be sure to check out the learning guide if you're interested in building your own. The link is in the description. Details like the super bright yellow LED, the rotary encoder, speaker grill, and fux gauges really make this look like a Pip-Boy 3000 Mark IV. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to subscribe for more 3D printing projects from Adafruit.